Hi guys, I'm here to show off, well, this and this. So last week, Tiny Tina's Wonderlands came out and I got the Chaotic Great Edition. Uh, I'm probably not going to end up playing it on stream for a while yet because I want to wait and see what the DLC roadmap is like because the Chaotic Great Edition comes with the ability to have all the future DLC. But yeah, I've heard great things about this game, and I am a big fan of both the uh, Borderlands franchise and the original uh, DLC Tiny Tina's Assault on Dragon Keep. And this is, well, the a box full of Tiny Tina's Wonderlands Treasure Trove, which is a merch box, and so I'm going to unbox. I'm going to unbox it here for you, for those of you who are curious. Um, if you are interested, um, now let me see here if I can get this without needing my Exacto knife. I might actually need my Exacto knife, so. Come on now. <sighs> okay. There we go. I apologize. I should have just done that to begin with. And now, unfortunately, the box is a little, uh, little less for wear, but that's okay. All right, my apologies. So, let's take a look at what we've got here. And if I can pull this out without, you know, wrecking it. <laughs> uh, behold, the Unicorn Princess Queen Butt Stallion. Yes, because it's Borderlands, so there you go. Uh, but in fact, here's right here, you can see the list of what the treasure trove includes. And I really like that. That's kind of, that's pretty cool. Um... Of course, the game's not included. Uh, a cloth map, which I will unbox here in a second. The problem, this is the problem with doing these unboxings, is that I admit that because I have no camera, or my camera is not like on me right now, I can't just like unbox and showcase. But yeah, this is a cloth map. Forgive the presentation, please. And that's just the box being knocked over. So this is the Wonderlands. This is the cloth map, which pretty cool. All the game's areas are here. I'll put that away after the unboxing is done. Uh, then we've got the... <laughs> Welcome to Neo Guns, Bunkers, Bunkers and Badass Standalone Module, which, by the way, um, in case you are curious, that is in fact the name of the game uh, that within the game, like the game within the Borderlands universe, uh, that they, it's basically like I uh, said, it's Dungeons and Dragons set in the Borderlands universe, and uh, Bunkers and Badasses is, is the name of that game. This is... It's times like this when you wish you had a third hand, you know? <laughs> Welcome, crybabies, to the future. The year's 2020X. Neogun City. I can tell that this is probably, uh... This is probably a parody of, uh... This might, in fact, be a parody of, uh... Cyberpunk, if I'm not mistaken, I would think. So there's your, uh, there's your contents. It's pretty cool. Little booklet here. You can look at and read. There's a, a paper model of the Tiny Tina's Wonderland, Once Upon a Butt Stallion Castle paper model. I'm not going to open that and build that because uh, I do not have... Uh, because I do not want to take up everybody's time with that video uh, in the video. 
the companions, p- companion pins here that you can get in the game. And again, I'm not going to open these. But then, last but not least, box of tarot cards. And let's see if I can open these without it taking forever in a day. Got it. Got it, got it. Okay. Let me, sorry, let me just see if I, I'm just sorry for that. I was trying to open the thing here and don't know where to set it down. Set down my phone. I don't have a stand, so. Oh, I think I op- I'm opening it the wrong way. That's why. Because I'm supposed to probably open it like this. Yes. So I'm supposed to open it. Don't worry, you didn't miss anything. And figured it, and figures that the fool would be the first, and that it would feature claptrap as the fool. I'm sorry, I'm just going to put that down for a second because I can't quite... I can't quite get the tarot cards without setting the thing down, my phone down, so apologize for the black screen. All right, here we go. Page of Swords, Knight of Swords, Ten of Swords, Eight, Seven of Swords. I don't know if these are so much tarot cards as they are decks, uh, deck of cards uh, game. I think you are forgetting that. That's not how it works. Knight of Cups, Two of Cups. Okay, so instead of uh, discs, or instead of like the suits, you've got cups, you've got discs, you've got wands, and you've got swords. So those aren't tarot cards. Those are normal playing cards, or at least normal, like, suited style playing cards. But this, there are some other tarot cards, like legitimate tarot cards. Claptrap the Fool, Tiny Tita the Magus. The High Priestess, who I think that's a character from Borderlands 3 because I'm not familiar. I haven't played Borderlands 3 yet, or the pre-sequel yet. Which is another reason why I'm not playing Wonderlands right away. The Empress. Yeah. The Emperor. The Hierophant. More like Hierohat. (laughs) The Lovers. Okay. Whatever you say. The Chariot. Justice, the Hermit, Fortune, D20, nice, Strength, Torg, (laughs) Heavy Metal Dude, The Hanged Man, Death, Temperance, the Devil, the Tower, the Star, (laughs) the Moon, the Sun, the Aeon, and the Universe, and then it just goes back to the uh, suited cards like I mentioned. So that's it. I mean, it's pretty cool little package here. Bunkers and Badasses role-playing game knockoff booklet, interactive booklet, cloth map of the entire game. The game, obviously, Chaotic Great Edition. 
uh, the pins of companions that you can get in this game, I'm assuming. Once Upon a Butt Stallion Castle paper model, which I have not built and probably will not build for some time. And then, last but not least, the, the uh, Butt Stallion plush. So yeah, that's the Tiny Tina's Wonderland's Treasure Trove. Uh, if you guys are interested in the unboxing, I believe GameStop sells this, and I'm sure Gearbox Online sells it. And if you're interested in the game, uh, I hope to one day eventually stream it online and play it on or on Twitch rather. But uh, I'm not gonna make any promises about when I'm going to do so because I want to see the DLC come out first. Oh yeah, you're looking at my floor here. I'll turn around here and have you look at me. Um, before I go, I just want to mention, uh, that I will be streaming Ghost of Tushinima on my Twitch, JP at JP the Orange Lantern on Twitch TV at probably about 1, 1 today, PM today. So if you guys are at all interested and if you aren't a follower of me and if you know somebody who would be interested in just, or who's always looking for new people to follow on Twitch, I'd appreciate you sending them my way. Otherwise, I hope you all have a lovely rest of your Thursday, wherever you are. And I will see you guys if you watch me on Twitch there. And if not, I'll see you see all when I see you. If, you know, sorry, rambled, bleh, done. Thank you. Have a nice day. Goodbye, everybody.